watch Black Quotation movie. It's the same. We have been thinking about doing something that engaged the public in science, and uh, but didn't know what it, what the shape was, what it was called, and and it was the perfect aha moment. Just Beakerhead, that's the name. When we went to school, we were all separated into math and engineering, or art and creativity. And it doesn't really serve us as individuals or the community. You know, we end up with the art world over here and the engineering sector over here. Um, and as an economy, it doesn't help either because you end up with these silos and it's where they intersect that in innovation really sparks. So by putting together uh, science and engineering with art, we run into so many people who say, oh, finally I have a chance to do this. Whether it's the engineers doing something artistic or the artists doing something with an engineering flavor to it. And why should we frustrate people like that? Let's give them an opportunity to do what maybe secretly they've wanted to do all along. In the very first year, we brought in quite a few people from San Francisco, Barcelona, England. We had to, we brought a lot of examples of what we had in mind from other parts of the world, and they were blown away. And it reminded us that the perception of Calgary doesn't actually match with the reality. And if people think Calgary is sort of a hidebound, super conservative corporate city, I think it's pretty evident, even if you just walk around in this city, it's not like that, and it's changing, and we're, I'd like to think we're kind of helping propel that change, but it's also true we're kind of riding that wave. So we don't want to make a career out of bringing artworks and engineered works from other cities and other countries and other continents yes. to Calgary. We have to do a little bit of it to sort of light the flame, but in the end, if it were all created here, that'd be fantastic.